Well, good morning. It is Friday. We have finally made it to the end of the work week, and as we head towards the holiday weekend, the weather doesn't look like a complete washout, but we'll see a couple chances for some scattered showers and storms tonight and again during the day on Saturday. Here's a live look outside this morning in East Lansing, waking up to plenty of sunshine out there. A pretty nice start to our day. We are going to notice increasing clouds as we go throughout the morning and into the afternoon hours. You can see that on your satellite and radar. A lot of those clouds already starting to work their way into the region. We do see at least a couple couple showers trying to work the way across Lake Michigan right now. This little band of rain will work at least into some areas. We'll see a few stray showers later this morning and early this afternoon, but the main event actually holds off until later tonight. This warm front down to our south will be pushing its way to the north. That will usher this area of high pressure out of here, allowing for showers and thunderstorms to develop mainly overnight and into the early morning hours on Saturday. So your future track as we go hour by hour again, we should be dry for most of the morning, although we can't rule out the chance for a stray shower later this afternoon. Not a complete washout by any means, and any rain we do see this afternoon and evening will be short lived. We do see a break after that. It's not until after the sun sets, probably close to about 9 or 10 o'clock, that we'll start to see showers and thunderstorms working their way into the region right about midnight or so, noticing this broken line of storms crossing its way through the area, mainly while most of us are sleeping. These storms, though, could be potentially on the stronger side with some gusty winds and maybe some hail as they pass through the area. They stick around at least into early Saturday morning before they clear out. We'll see a short break Saturday afternoon, but then we do see another chance for some scattered storms to develop, mainly Saturday evening. This is right around 2 o'clock or so, but it's probably better close to around 6 or 7 that we'll start to see at least a couple storms, mainly along into the south of the I-69 corridor on Saturday afternoon and Saturday evening. And then it looks like we'll dry out just in time for our day on Sunday into Monday. So for today and tonight, we are expecting at least the chance for some severe weather. The Storm Prediction Center has placed parts of mid-Michigan under a slight risk this yellow color anywhere from Lansing and then points off to the west. A marginal risk for severe weather anywhere from Jackson and points off to the southeast. That just means that some of the storms tonight could contain some gusty winds as well as heavy rain and the potential for some hail as they move through. And again, most of those will come in after dark, close to around 10 o'clock and last into around 7 o'clock on Saturday morning. So for today, a little bit cooler compared to yesterday. 69 will be our high. Some locations could reach that 70 degree mark. Mostly cloudy with just a few stray showers later this afternoon. Tonight, that's when we we see those storms coming in. Some of them could be strong with some gusty winds. Lows right around 60 degrees. In your seven day forecast, we warm right back up tomorrow on Saturday with highs that get close to 80 degrees. Some scattered storms Saturday morning and again Saturday afternoon into Saturday evening. Looks like we'll be dry on Sunday and Monday with highs in the middle 70s and plenty of sunshine from our, our Memorial Day. And then we get even warmer next Tuesday. It looks like we could hit our first 80 degree day of the year. Wow. Okay, so I am crossing my fingers for that. For the 80 lie. degrees? Yes. yes, I know. Wow. It's it's almost we kind of almost need that summer like weather with Memorial Day coming in. Right? We do. Yeah, like you said, it's kind of like the the start of yeah, summer. Yeah, the unofficial start of summer is what some people call it. So. Yeah, ready to bust out the flip flops. Uh, yeah, the yeah. shorts. Yeah. 